all right what's up everybody welcome back to an all new video of god of war ragnarok time we're with brock where he will lead us to the forest Get it. you sure did go to pains coming here busting old tear loose what a prize he turned right. out to be huh lucid enough when it's time to steal my kitchen though Oh yeah, and what's up? And what's up to the Rumblers here? I'm, I'm this is my second stream on my Rumble channel. Uh, I, the first one was really was really good. I streamed for like eight hours. I mean, pretty I'm awesome. Right here, you bastards! Let go already! <laughs> Better take out that net, or it'll be eyeball city out here. <laughs> These mutts, no wonder they shut the door. Hey, Bunk come on. Hmm. What is this? Oh, oh, there's another adventure here. Oh, I thought I was supposed to put like a little portal. Okay, the door. Hang on. Almost got it. There. Well, come on in, stranger. Never do get used to that trick. Locals up ahead. Act civilized, and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, quit your nattering, you snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear. Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? Well, uh, that ain't no tear. You see what's wrong here, don't you? Oh, shit. Creepy flying eyeballs made a nest in the cave. We got a pair of way up there. The nest first. <laughs> For the nightmare haunt to release the Okay, looks like that wheel up there opens the gate. Not that we can reach it or anything. <laughs> no grappling up there. Why don't you look around and see if there's a way to lift this lift? <sighs> it's here. I take all, all things out. I can't go for it. <sighs> okay. Hang on, coming around. 
Brother, did you notice the dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Brock than they were to see you? They did seem surprised. All right. Mm -hmm. Did they? Turn it. Copy that. It will take us further, but we. Stop. I sure hope he doesn't repeat that line. Yeah, annoying. Hey, turn I it again. Vantage point, brother. Hey, I got the crank covered. You do the no. other stuff. Once more. Runic attack Atlas eruption. Two hundred wow, two hundred thirty seven thirty nine seconds are cool down. Wow. Now we can 
can ride on up to the forge. Come on, the lady's waiting. Hey, got another riddle for you. What gets bigger, the more you take away from it. Well, let's see. Something abstract, I expect. Appetite? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> stomp the stomp. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? Bam, what? Out on the right way. Oh, okay. We show it. I meant you magically appear on it. All right, Ooh, anyway. That's brisk. Think I'll grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Oh, watch and learn. See, dwarven magic. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah. I guess it's a little more damage. It's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? The nature of a thing's more important than the form of a thing. Hmm. Upgrade this one. Hang on. I smell trouble. <laughs> Show me what you got. chance to meet her since I was knee-high to a Noken. But Sindri had never have it. Said I was too uncouth. But today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> my bro, I've never seen you so reverent. Are you nervous? What? Shut up. No, fuck you. No would I ever talk the ability to know what this is. <laughs> Oh, fuck no. Do I got a 
fix everything in this dang city my own self. I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow me. Yeesh, if this place ain't in some disrepair, it's disrespectful, I tell you. I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. <clears throat> this lady, what does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessing. Doesn't give them to every piece, but the once she does, there's something to behold. Yes? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster. Maybe sometime I'll spin you that tape. Faye's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Back in those days, I'd get so caught up in trying to be the best that I'd work till I boom drop. And if those fine, there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own pace. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Like for when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. Gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? Desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, it's not perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me, that is. <laughs> All right, let's get back to business. One more crank to turn, and it's onto the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to the nature of one. I was almost following him for a moment there. We're good. Crank it. She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her your hand.
Alfie Vader almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might bless it for us. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? What the fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. A part specifically you might be missing. Fuck. Fuck! Damn it, Sindri, you lion's cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! the fuck do you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters. Not its form. All right. May this weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. You know I can't let you take our new gal home without Look! We got volunteers! Oh, nice. Ah, that's just stuff. It's your first time with the spear, I reckon. It is the first weapon a Spartan learned. What the hell? Ain't this just like old times? I think we could hit more rewardingly myself. <laughs> Awesome. Got a new weapon. Let's Pretty amazing. See if she can help us get out of here, too. Please. It appears like that. Pretty Up fucking there. amazing. See that weak spot? Jam one in right there. That's it. That's what I'm for. Yeah. Yep. Guess we're doing this one boy style. Uh, listen, uh, I appreciate what you said back there. It's good to have friends when you find out your brother's a rack scabbing liar. No doubt he only wished to protect you. Word his call to me. 
guy dies, he's got the right to know about it. Take heart, Brock. We all die sometime. Many of us more than once. No, never mind all that. We gotta finish putting the spirit through our paces. Come on. Might have to get creative up ahead. <laughs> Bigger the more you take away. Ah, is it time? Because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No. That's bollocks now that I say it. Never mind. <laughs> Today's all right. Lesson? Take note of that there, watch him a hoose. Get a decent angle and fling a spear into it head on. Oh, nice. It's Go all about the proper angle with those puppies. I'm telling you, you're too far to the side. Oh, nice. Like Good. A pull -up bar. Guess you get extra credit. Like a pull-up bar. One of Nicole's children! Put it in the trap! you or anything you did not right uh, you can bring 
take that back to Ratatos group whenever you're ready. of the both of you and we can call a square what happened down there in the forge with the lady that's my story to tell all right agreed oh very well these ugly bugs maybe those grim will take him down uh, nope <laughs> Set up shop over yonder. Oh, good. I like a uh, light attack on my spear. Thanking someone.
Reckon I see how you'll be getting down from up here. Best I find my own way back. Been too auspicious a day to end it working and working. Oh, is that the way down? And I'll get those gates working for you! I only hope Sindri's in one piece by the time Brock's done with him. The ice beneath those two is thin enough under the best of circumstances. everyone now a good time I just want to talk Get glad Odin. to dad speaking of which imagine my surprise when Atreus came knocking at my door he's doing well by the way and will continue to do so just as long as I return to Asgard Sometime soon. Besides, our friend here has a has a whole lot to live for. Arguable. Run along now, but behave yourself. <sighs> New spear. Never much cared for Brock. Can't deny the dwarf's talent. You came to speak. Speak. You don't really want war, do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands, on your son's hands. I want peace as much as you do. Perhaps we can find it together. He's lying. I know. That boy of ours is everything I expected. So clever. Fine. Be sure he's yours. A kid. You really ought to be very proud. He is the key to peace in our age, to break free from all this fate and prophecy. My son is not your key. Oh, God, do they not have metaphor in your homeland? Or rather, did they? I'm sorry, that's not fair. I know you're not the god you once were. And now is your chance to prove it. Return my son, or you may meet the god I once was. And what kind of god is that, Kratos? What do you even know of godhood? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! You don't care about mortals. You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. You fear what you can never even hope to understand. Is it any wonder that your boy is in no rush to come back to you? Don't listen to him, brother. He's just trying to get in your head. Superior bastard. The nerve of him showing up here. At least you rattled him as much as he rattled you. Oh, this is off. Oh. At Odin. Try to get inside Kratos' head. Ah. Oh. He doesn't fall through.
the new weapon a spear one with the powers of dropnia interesting well come on we can discuss it on the train i do worry though if i'm being frank we've crafted a weapon to kill a god one could say you're on the verge of returning to form does it scare you aiding another violent god i'm scared for you brother that spear could start a war the war if that no longer concerns you then maybe freya's right Maybe the Giants had you in mind all along. As long as you remember we can't get home this way, we'll need to take the train down. survived a giant's corpse to a stop a certain fight we won't talk about could you call on that power again maybe do you have a massive giant's corpse for me to revive uh no well there you go the wrong way the but you the right way I probably was I had to go, I thought I was supposed to go down here right tool for the job.
Nice. So this drop near Spear, you're prepared to use it? To protect Atreus. I am no one's champion but his, nor no one's god. That may be my form. It is not my nature. Do you understand? I guess a difference of opinion is hardly the most I'm setting aside for this alliance. As long as the plan is to kill Heimdall, the rest matters little. There's also the bit of news that Odin has some inkling of what we're up to. I thought I heard ravens. Damn it. What did he say? Lies, threats, and more lies. What did you expect? You think he lies that Atreus is in Asgard? No. On that, I'm afraid I believe him. Then the rest matters little. I saw a gateway near here, overlooking the bay. We can get to it with your spear, I think. This way. Ooh. Another Berserker Gravestone. You know what to do, brother. Right. <sighs> 